They have like you're standards. not allowed to fly in. Like yeah, they have fucking standards. Like an Ethan person. What the fuck is that? They have standards, Jerry. I'm guessing over there is where they have, uh, that special, that VTuber. Yeah, that city is where the VTuber is. I'm not going to the VTuber. I gotta take care of Mr. Crab. I fucking love, uh, Ion. She's amazing. Iono? I think her name is Iono, not Ion. What, what happened? Amazing. Oh, okay. Can I oh, voice yeah. the screen? No. Yeah? Fuck you. Ah, it's you. you. Yeah, you. right. Yeah. So apparently he had his ass handed like I said before, my name's Clive. Don't forget it. Anyway, Aaron, I owe you one. Thanks to you, I've been accepting Operation Starfall. What's your end game? <laughs> I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve this situation with Team Star? What's causing its members' odd behavior? Odd behavior? Team Star is the subject of more than a few nasty rumors swirling around the academy, you know. Some say their bullying has caused a worrying of number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors. The fact that I am, I am directly confronted with this is something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistent trancy. They've all been skipping class for a while now. Five of them in particular, these so-called bosses of Team Star, haven't so much set a foot inside a classroom for over a year. And it seems the team's rank and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well. That's why I took upon myself to issue a direct order from Team Star to disband. I informed them that that should they refuse, I would have no choice but to expel all students affiliated with their team. But I'm afraid there's no response. And the deadline is set for them to make their choice between dissolution or expulsion is night upon us. So you see, when I overheard you t talking on the phone to Cassipia, it couldn't have come at a more crucial time. It's Cassipia. Can you hear me? An another time then. Be careful. I see you're coming up with one of Team Star's bases. Was there someone with you just now? I'll be warned that Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss to you already. This base won't go down as easily as the last one. Proceed with extreme ca caution. I'll be in touch. God damn it, this fucking thing. Well, the thing is, I'm not going to attack that. If you want to get to the city, you have to. I'm not going to the city, I'm going to attack the crab. Oh yeah, crab. <laughs> So, I have to... Wait... Oh, I... I'm an idiot. <laughs> I, I'm going farther away. Yeah, I got a pseudo-legendary. Let's fucking go. I don't care. Fuck you. Ooh, Dragon Rush. Hell yeah. Learn. Hmm. Ooh, dark type. I can challenge this alone. And it's three stars. Okay. Should you be using the the, the ghost type? You know, the, the the one a week against. It'll be dark fine. Type. It'll be fine. Right. You should have brought a fairy type. I don't have. Oh wait, I do. Is that dark type? Yes. That doesn't look like the... The dark type thing looks weird. Flamethrower! 
Burn it too, Chris. It's not doing much damage to me. You know, it's super effective. Burn it! Ha, I burned him. And we're whooping your ass. How do you feel about it? Yeah, fuck you. I don't think it likes it. I can never use a Pokeball again. Fuck, is that another two star thing? What the fuck it is? I think. You'll never know. No, it says Jim. Or is it? Fuck you! <laughs> I love being an annoying ass bitch. Uh, this subathon is starting off just great. Oh, there, yeah, but there you want there, and it's too strong. Sure it is. <laughs> yeah, you haven't done, you haven't drinking any alcohol, so I don't know if it's how well it's going. I don't have any. I'm poor. Oh. Anyway, Sableye, Darkness Pokemon. Materials from gems it has eaten float to the surface of its body and can form an, an infinite number of patterns among individuals. No. Oh, the ice gym isn't even a part of a town. It's just the gym in a Poke Center. That's depressing. Yeah. I think it's a ski resort. That's just sad. My Coridon is having a stroke. Okay, Garter 4 is done. Let's get the chonk. Hey, Dragon, are you still upset that you don't have the chonk? What? Oh, yeah, I need to get the big boy. I thought you had LeChonk. I thought you had the... Yeah, I have a shiny LeChonk. LeChonk. No, I mean THE Chonk. There's a difference between LeChonk and THE Chonk. Bright has THE Chonk. Chonk. You mean you want one of all? I, I need the, the Paladonian version of the Wolfer. Oh, you mind. need the boy version? No. No, uh, they want the Whooper evolution that I called the Chonk. Oh. The axolotl. Oh. I'm very sad that they removed the inside of the stores. Like it's such a small thing, but it's just why. Son of a bitch. You'll get over here and let me eat your insides. I don't think that's how... Okay.
are about to terra stabilize our the Gyarados. Excuse me. One, there's a minor enchant, and two, I'm pretty sure doing that against someone's will is illegal. Wait, what? What's the? What happened? You just one hit the fucking crab. Wait, I'm confused. What? What happened? Who knows? Eating someone's incest. I was talking about the crab. I was talking about the crab. Yeah, yeah, that's a you problem for thinking that. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> Don't get cracked. Someone in chat now. has a dirty mouth. Up oh, here comes everyone's vo favorite voice lines. Even break you, you finuity. And that thing's a stony cliff titan. No cuff has. Got any business from being that big? Is it gonna be even stronger now after eating those herbs? Let's watch your sales even break. This is a little rough. Shoulder, let's serve up a helping of defeat on on half shell. And so now that it's almost midnight, I'm gonna try to get a Korean or Japanese ditto. No. Fuck you. <laughs> I one shot at it. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure that's one of the earlier uh, ones you're supposed to go after. The first one I went after was the bird. The bird? I went after the bird second. The bird was pretty easy. All hail bird. Oh! The chonk leveled up. Hell yeah. All hail the chonk. Alright, look at my little bunny coming through like a champ. But these Titan Pokemon are yeesh. I sure don't have like having something so tough out to get me. A bit somewhere in here there's more of that Herbert Mystica the Titan was eating. Quick, let's have a look around before it comes back. I'm sure there's some here, too. Aha! I knew it! I spy Herba Mysticus! Another successful search. We're on a roll. Now then, let's see. What does this book have to say? It says here that sweet herba mystica is good for gut health and helps a digestion. It say it's good for stomach aches too, or when you want to simulate the old appetite. This will definitely help Mab with stiff feeling better. Come on, Aaron Bright. Let's get some food going. Yeah, hey, yeah, watch out. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go, another of your favorite old Ivan sandwiches. It comes with a special Titan badge. Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. Hi, 
I really hope by the end of Arvin's uh, arc, I really hope that you feel bad for bullying him. Nah. I really hope that you feel bad. I really do. I don't think the character has been bullied. <laughs> no, not in game, but Bright's been bullying the character. Right, what have you been saying about the idiot? <laughs> Jerry! <laughs> Jerry! <laughs> the only thing I've been doing. They were a bad person. All I've been doing was giving them this, this awful accent. Beardus might happen. I want a penguin that their characters they like even more that have even worse voices. <laughs> anyway. Beardus might happen. No worry. I mean, actually, it's time for that brute of yours. Come on out, Mabba Stiff. Got some for you too, bud. It's it, small bites, small bites. Why did I just? <sighs> I'm trying to get a Masuda method. Fucking ditto, and it's just I keep getting. Come on. One idiot. At, at least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would you? This brute seems to be benefiting from the herbs too. I guess it's in its own sort of way. Oh yeah, before I forget, Aaron, take another look at this. There's always a Titan for near Herbert Mystica when we find him, right? Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that's making the Titan so big and strong. Yeah, that's true, Bookworm. So does that mean a Titan's lair isn't really some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? Are you done with your sandwich, Mabu Steve? You, you heard that right, Aaron. Mabu Steve's got just woofed, right? Yes. Right. I am not imagining things. See? See that? I knew I wasn't just hearing things. Oh, Mabo Stiff. Who is my best bud, huh? Who is the best of boys? You are. Yes, you are. Yeah, I could have said no. <laughs> It's, it's been so long since I heard that wolf. Mabo Stiff is definitely getting better. Ever since I teamed up with you, good things keep happening. But we still got two more herds to go. Hope you'll stick it out till we're done. Hello, Aaron Bright. This is Terrell. I detect that Moriadon has gained more of its original power. It seems that you build a dash at high speeds while you're riding upon it. Please continue to take good care of Moriadon. Oh yeah, this is faster now, bitches. Wee hoo hoo. Wait, which uh, which that was your third or fourth? Probably, yeah, because I got the dash ability. That's that should have been your. That's weird. Maybe it does depend on legend, because I thought it didn't depend on legend. I thought it just. Hmm. 
So if it was your third, it should have been glide, and if it was your fourth, then you would be able to climb up walls. Nope. Hmm. Typing intensifies this. The writing a thesis on why we we need to annoy that character. <laughs> I'm sorry. I want to do violence to you. <laughs> I hope someone gets that reference. No. Fuck you. <laughs> Yeah, what I'm thinking of doing is going to bed at 1 today. That, because it's a subathon. So, we got like an hour and 30 minutes. <laughs> the 2 damage. I could have just cut it with a normal Pokeball. I could have. But I have the perfect number of Pokeballs and I don't want to ruin it. What's the number? 69. You little shit. <laughs> Needs to be ruined. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Cheery. It's perfect. No. <laughs> that needs to be ruined. <laughs> that needs to be ruined. <laughs> Drowsy, the hypnosis Pokemon. When it twitches its nose, it can tell whether someone is sleeping and what the person is dreaming about. Damn it. I just want a fucking foreign ditto so I can read my Pokemon easier and get a shiny more likely. More Did you just say you just want a orange ditto for breeding? <laughs> yeah. An orange. Yeah, ditto don't become orange. <laughs> no, for foreign. Foreign. Ditto. <laughs> Do you want an orange ditto? Uh, actually, yeah, ditto being orange would be pretty cool. Technically, it can become orange. Actually, according to its sky, uh, Scarlet Pokedex, uh, ditto can keep a perfect transformation unless you make it laugh. This makes traveling out around a lot faster. I just want a Japanese fucking ditto. I could, I would take a Korean one. I just want, ah, I want a foreign ditto. You're weird. I need one. It's a game mechanic. Oh. Good luck. No. Yes. So have ditto watch a bunch of try not to oh. launch. Launch challenge. Also, I think I need to find all one. my work clothes and start go doing laundry things. Amen. But I don't want to move. Fair. After I take this base, I'm just going to do a bunch of wonder trading. Just to see what I get. I could trade you a Pokemon if you want one. Nah. I'm going to leave the stream because although I'd love yeah. to stay here more, I feel like I lost most of my day to work and sleeping in late. That's because fair. Because I did not know I'd have work. That's fair. Yeah. Night, night. Night. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't be here. This space belongs to Team Star. If you don't clear out real quick, 
I'll have to come at you in self-defense, you get me? Well, alright. Uh, Time for me to self-defense the, the snot right out of you. And I'm about to whoop your ass. Oh, thank fuck. I think I got my ditto. I think I finally got the ditto I want. Please, please, person, please don't cancel trade. We are literally, we are... Please. Why would you quit? You want an English ditto because it's also foreign to your country. Ah, motherfucker, why? Why? <laughs> this is the second Japanese person that has canceled fucking trading, even though we literally have each other, like, what we each other need, and they just fucking quit. It's like, why? Okay. Why? Is my ditto not good enough for you? Watch me in, even like, Wonder we... Trade, I get a Japanese ditto. If you get a Japanese ditto, I will literally give you a, fifth, a level 50 fucking, like, Pokemon if you give it to me. <laughs> Maybe. Fuck you, Kane. I don't want you. Fuck you. Man, you're crazy. You're crazy. Strong. Wait, are you that kid who declared foreign team star? Whoa. Thanks for the terrible news. Excuse me while looking back. Looking it back to the rest of my crew. Hello, the V star. Well, I'm gonna hope this new person. Put in a thing. Hey, Aaron Bright. Cannoli told me to scope out the fire crew's base. I thought I, I'd come give you some backup now. That I'm through, but seems you're all set. What? <gasps> Is it the little guy? Yes, little guy. Yes. It's the little guy. I want the ghost one though. Oh no, that's just that's just what the pre-evolution looks like. It looks like that in my game too. Oh, so we can evolve to the ghost one? Mm-hmm. Yours okay. evolves into the ghost one, mine evolves into the cool red one. Oh, okay. But you do have to do some grinding to get the material needed to evolve it. Is that you Charlos? I thought so. What are you doing here? This is Pokemon News. This is Charlos, the Char Cadet. He's one of the Pokemon the cat the Pokemon He's one of the Pokemon the Academy takes care of within its grounds. Ah, cut Charlos, wait! He ran off. Looks like he may have some connection to Team Star's fire crew. I'd better chase after him. Don't worry. I'll regroup with you soon enough. You press ahead in, into the base, Aaron. Alright, I'm about to whoop this fire bitch's ass. Please give me this ditto, please, please, please. I see you've dealt with the grunt standing guard. Nice work. Station what? inside the base is Team Star's fire crew. The... Shidar squad. Their boss, Mela, is the best all-rounder of the team. She fixes any and every problem thrown her way, though her methods are heavy-handed. Our declaration of war must have made her blood boil. I bet even now, she grunts... Her grunts are hard at work inside the base, trying to keep her f fury under control. That means her best move... Your best move is to take down all the grunts... Nice and quick. Once there's no one left to help me a lot, keep her cool. She should come out to comfort you. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe off Shadar Squad off the map. Please, please, for the love of fuck, just trade me a Japanese goddamn ditto. This is the third fucking person and they just quit and it's like we literally they, i'm giving you what you want you gave me what i want but they're just ah this is painful please why oh 
All right, time to whoop your asses. English ditto. Oh, Japanese ditto. Uh, three, two, three, three. Oh, I gotta do that. that why? Why aren't you killing? Kill! I am telling you to kill. Thank you, Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! Hit! Why are you not doing what you're supposed to? My goodness! Thank you, Jesus Christ! Now is the game's actually let me do what I want. It was so annoying. No, why? I don't want the surprise trade. I want the fucking gold link trade. That's oh. wonder trade, right? Surprise trade? Yeah. I don't know why they changed it from Wonder Trade. Yes, yeah, it's, it's literally the same, same thing. Oh, God damn it, it's not letting me doing it again! Stop like running away! Go to Chonk! Oh my gosh, he looks so adorable walking! The Chonk is so adorable! I love that Chonk. Wait, can the Chonk evolve more? I don't think so. He can't become more chonky. Oh. So you're the dope. So you're the dev who picked a fight with Team Star. I don't know who... I don't know why you, you would do something so stupid. I don't care. Who challenged us so, we, so we'll beat you down. That's all there is to it. Prepare to get messed up. Yeah, well I'm gonna whoop your ass. I got water types, you got fire types. Right here, right now, you're going down. Did I do it? I think. I think I finally got a Japanese ditto. Did you? Yes! Finally! 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 I, I, I'm hoping it is a Japanese ditto and I did not get just fucked over by someone with a Japanese name. 
if it if it says ditto and it's a Japanese name, or if it's Japanese, uh, it's not kan. Is it kanji? Oh, it's yes. Finally, I don't think it's kanji. I forget what the. Oh my god! Thank you. Oh my god! I finally have a Japanese ditto. I can finally. Oh my god. Finally. Now if I want to uh, shiny hunt for a shiny uh, Appleton, I can get one. Or a shiny starter. Oh my god. I ain't burned two equips just yet. I'm just gonna move this to a different box and then move my party. Which one do I want, though? The question. The shiny one. Um, you know what? Butternut. I'm getting a shiny. Butternut's child will be a shiny, or one of them at least. You know, I want to stream till two again. I'm just gonna be doing Wonder Trade till the very, very end. Maybe I'll get something good. I'm guessing that's, uh, that means that you're probably gonna catch, like, a bunch of, uh, like, random-ass Pokemon. Oh, I, do I already have a full box of random-ass Pokemon. That I caught. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it froze. Oh. Yeah, whoop the ass, bitch. I think right here is a perfect place to have a picnic. <laughs> Look, you have to set the romantic move for the Japanese ditto in the the flapple. No. Uh, uh, is this uh, really how it's gonna end? What a hassle. Egg power. There we are. Egg power. About a year and a half ago. Man, what a hassle. Pulled it off just in time. Welcome back, Melly. I managed to get a bunch of the Charcadet to evolve. That ought to be enough to power the Starmobile and finally get that hunk of metal rolling. Glad tidings indeed, is it not, Ortega? I'm just surprised she's not all hot hair. Oh shit, with the snide comments. You can be such an annoying twerp, you know that? And if you're any better, Mela. Being rude and saying mean things is literally your whole, I whole deal. It's not true, Ordy. The girls at the academy have always been jealous of how cute Melly is. She just puts a, a sorry attitude so they stop picking on her. Although I guess you're not wrong to say that her sorry attitude is what people will know her for. What? Come on, not you too, Airy. How about we leave it to that, folks? It's almost time for the big event! Yes. Operation Star is finally happening. And a big boss? What prey is their plan? They already got in touch with the bullies and asked them to head over to the schoolyard. It's finally time, huh? Man, I'm so stoked. The throw is burning me up. I burned through everything I had, and now I've sputtered out. Guess this is where it ends. The Gyarados of yours really let us have it. Beat me in battle is a huge deal, so here, take this star badge and be proud of yourself. She tried breaking my arm! What are your thoughts on how Mellow walks? She looks stupid as fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Not even gonna deny it. Well, while I'm at it, you can have this TM too. Not like I'm gonna use it. Flame charge. Okay. Let me make one thing clear. I'm not giving these to you. I'm giving them to your Gyarados. You got what you came for, Ned. Leave me alone. You're a metal from Team Star, right? There's a Pokemon I'd like you to see. Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Hey, Charcadet. Oh, 
target it? Wait. Well, if, if, if it ain't Charlos, what are you doing here? It seems he came to the space looking for you. You, you did? He's very attached to you, isn't he? Yeah, because I used to play with him every day back when I was still going to school. I can't even tell more or less. Oh, fuck. Do you have any idea where Charles wanted... Why Charles wanted to visit you? Charles. To me, it looks like he's saying he wants you to come back. Just shut it, Ari, would you? They say Team Star has holed its itself up in these bases to plot something against the Academy. Were you aware of this? First I heard some stupid rumor like that. Man, nothing's changed since back then. Everyone's still spatting garbage. Then what about that modified car you were watering around in just now? The Starmobile? We made that thing a long time ago to help us out with, with a big fight. But we never actually used it against anyone before you two came looking for trouble. You never used it before? Then what's this about a big fight? You ever heard of Operation Star? Operation Star? Not Operation Starfall? No, this is the first time hearing of it. Huh, well, I guess you wouldn't know. But for me and the rest of Team Star, it's a memory we will always treasure. Right, do you want to know a fun fact? No. Fuck you. Uh, fun fact, if you when you're p having a picnic, uh, you can actually wash your Pokemon. Okay. Oh. Aaron Wright, it's me. I take it that Mellow Star Badge is now in your possession. I see. Now there's no boss to lead them. The rest of Shatter Squad shouldn't last long. Mella. Sorry, I got distracted for a second there again. Now, about your reward. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone as promised. What does LP mean? Loser points. Little Pokemon? Oh. <laughs> 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 Adurna! Oh my god! Oh. Yeah. Here's... Okay. Use these new TMs to strengthen your Pokemon even further. I'll have the supply unit refs meet you shortly to deliver some bonus materials too. Oh, that makes sense, Bookworm. <laughs> Hello, it's me again from supply unit. What? What, what the oh. heck? If you want, I can. If you want, I can voice, voice her. Because like she literally has some of how I speak. If you want to, sure. Stop that. Yeah. Hey, that. This is somebody. Oh. I'm not gonna scream that, but. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it trolled all over me. What, what even is that Pokemon anyway? I have no idea what it is. <laughs> huh. It's amazing you're so calm. With a giant question mark of a Pokemon at your side. <sighs> Uh, um, but before I forget, uh, here's your reward. Ah, Pokemon materials. Hang on one sec. Uh, your name's Aaron, right, right? One sec. Trying to get back. Ah, there we go. 
since you're part of Operation Starfall's battery unit, can I ask you something? Yeah. What, what do you think of Team Star? Interesting. Watch her be a member of Team Star. Yeah. <clears throat> You know, some of the rumors say Team Star wasn't always a bunch of delinquents. Most of them used to be victims of bullying, or they just found it hard to interact with people. Damn. But then these misfits and outsiders found each other and bound banded together to form Team Star. All they wanted to do was push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. <clears throat> but, uh, uh that, that, that's just info I got by hacking other students' social media account accounts. That's illegal. Or she's lying. Yeah, she could have been one of those, like, original members. That might be why they were picking on her <clears throat> at the beginning. Mm -hmm. You don't know Parmesan laws. <laughs> I also found talk about some secret mastermind behind the five bosses. Uh, so, someone who recruited them to the team in the, the first place. Are they the f Oh my god, it would be hilarious if they're in the mastermind. I, I don't normally talk this much. Now my throat kind of hurts. <coughs> Perfect coughing time. So, um, good, good luck with checking um, the other bases and stuff. I love Penny. <laughs> Lily Hatchet. I return! You turn it at the right time, because... Um... I was good, Bean. As soon as, as soon as I saw her first... Her first line of dialogue, I was like, "Yep, yeah, no, nope, no, nope. you know, I love her." He, she is. Look, she may not be canonically trans, but she has uh, trans girl swag. If that makes any fucking sense. She is. Okay, I would say she's pr pretty much literally me, <laughs> like with how like Damn I it. speak and shit. Fuck off, like, literally Sinosaur. speaking shit. Like, not... I wouldn't say look-wise, but, like... But, like, I... The, my speech is has a lot more of that with it. A little bit more of that with it. Let's see, who are... But honestly, like... Go ahead. Oh, hey, Hatch. Whoa. Oh. Are you? Hey, are you? Let's see. Walls and chat. Okay. But yes, I return to work on more cards. Yeah. Also, uh, since uh, Dern is here, we can talk about a certain agent now. Oh dear gods. I am uh, I am curious, but well, also well. very afraid. Uh you remember how Agent Zeus had the power of fifty lightning bolts constantly searching through their body? Yeah. Wait, like fifty lightning bolts? Yeah, that's what I said. Uh I did the math um, to see how many <laughs> voltage it was. Uh fifteen billion volts. Yes, that's fifteen billion volts. 
into it, one lightning bolt that goes across their body. Well, actually, into like one, into like fifty different lightning bolts. But like you take, you take one of those lightning bolts, and it's the exact same. It's just the same voltage that is circulating around the body. It's just with like fifty different like streaks of it. Yeah, it's not. It's not that much. Like, <clears throat> we we decided to it, do that, three to that's five. Not how, like, that's not how like voltage works because that's not how voltage works unless you were trying to do something where like they're like uh they're as powerful as like fifty lightning bolts put together or some shit like that, which would honestly feel feels weird to say. And like having like fifty lightning bolts surge around the body is actual actually makes more sense than like uh, that other thing. So yeah, like yeah, I'm... no, it's not that more, that big a voltage. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, Hatch. Uh, um, getting distracted by stuff. Um, from my okay. understanding, Bright was meaning it that. That like all of that level of voltage is constantly emitted from the person's body at all times. Yeah. That's it. yeah. So all of that voltage. At all times. And then mm. like I had like had a little thing in the back of my mind thinking, wait, that sounds a little overpowered, but I was also too lazy to give a damn at the yeah. time. And then well, we like, got I the top. I'd say, right, I'd say go with the, like, pull, like, be, like, have, like, the light, like, where the like, electricity is just, like, different, like, lightning bolts going around the body, because I feel like that would make more sense, and also, no, like, we, we possibly downgraded make them the, a little less overpowered. We, da <laughs> we downgraded their okay. power to three to five volts electricity. To 100 Lightning No, <laughs> the three to five volts are sur constantly sorry, surging. Sorry, I hadn't made. Yeah. So, three to five volts. An average lightning bolt is three hundred million volts of electricity. Three hundred million. So yeah. So maybe you could have like. <clears throat> maybe you could have like different like. Three or five like lightning bolts that like surge around them, or something. Oh yes. Uh, so, actually, bright. Are you all right with honestly, me? Honestly, just... that makes more sense than fifty. I I think I think this is I think this might be the, just the best way to get across how entertaining this interaction was. Bright, do you consent to me just reading the DMs out yeah. loud? Go ahead. All right. So, uh. Just a little bit of talking about, uh, wait, where did, where did, where did it start? God damn it. Okay, so, it starts with, uh, bright. Yeah, I had no idea how much a light, how much a lightning bolt's voltage was when I made the character. I saw. Me. Ye. In the back of my, <laughs> ye. Yeah, in the back of my head, I had that concern, but I was also, but I also was too lazy to follow up on it. Well, headaches are a hell of a drug. Uh, right. I'll probably downgrade them to three to five lightning bolts instead of fifty. Me. Yeah, that seems a bit better. Hell, while we're on the topic of volts, it might just be better to pick a particular voltage, and say that rather than measuring it in. Kind of at abstract scale of lightning bolts. Just basically say how much voltage he's putting out. Then Bright talks about that a bit, and then that, that is honestly like that is unless you want like the bolt, the lightning bolt should be like absolutely streaming get, get across the body. Yeah, oh I no, don't think that, that's like, what like Bright that, was going for. No, yeah, their character's backstory is gonna be incredibly depressing. Yeah. Oh. Let's see, and then, um, Brett goes on. 
I also just realized if anyone touched, if anyone touched them at the million, five, 15 billion voltage, they would probably be incinerated. Me. You just now realized that. Right. Shut up. Well, they wouldn't be in. They wouldn't even be able. They wouldn't okay. even be able to like be within like probably like five feet potentially. Yeah. And uh, me anyway. So me. Well, they wouldn't be incinerated per se, but they sure as hell wouldn't be living to tell about it. Oh God, what if he fell in a swimming pool with people in it? Is what I said. Bright well, says, you... oh. Oh, "It would be uh, quite shocking." Uh, Bright says, "Oh, oh God!" I say he would be the toaster in the giant bathtub. Bright laughs. Uh, keep this guy the fuck away from water. Bright says, "They can't go to family gatherings." <laughs> I just realized that their mother had one hell of a birth. <laughs> and I say, "Holy fucking shit!" I would hope this manifested later. Otherwise, she is fucking toast. They can't go out in the fucking rain. Every puddle every puddle turns into a death trap. Anything metal around the puddle gets electrocuted and short circuits. They could fucking cripple a city's infrastructure just by taking a casual stroll. And then Bright says, oh god. Oh my god. Yeah, they're definitely getting nerf nerfed. And then I say in all caps, WHAT HAVE YOU CREATED?! If you think about it, technically they uh, would be able- they would be like the Voltorb of the SCP universe. Maybe. Bright- Bright does XD and then I say, Get the nerf gun quick! Downgrade this motherfucker to a light bulb or something's fucking hell. Down- To a light bulb or something. Fucking hell. And, uh, let's see. Bright laughs. I like how we were worried about- Agent Viral being overpowered when Agent Zeus was sitting in the corner being their overpowered self. So yeah, I guess the prospect of an uncontrolled global pandemic mm -hmm. was a bit more viscerally notice uh, noticeable compared to the human Tesla coil. Mm. And that's... Yeah, that's pretty much the it for that line of conversation. It was quite entertaining. Well, Tesla coil... Physical relationship with plasma. So, listen. Honestly, that would be pretty cool to see. Listen. Listen. I was trying to come up with something that had to do with electricity, and that was the first thing that came to mind. I'm not a scientist. Give me a break. You should be. No. Uh, no. That takes an un. Become a scientist with it. Yeah. No. Oh, that sad. takes an unreasonable amount of effort that I am not going to do. You could be the the the, the science rat. Also, the uh, apparently, rat? I I got lucky and got another starter. That's not how the. Wait, which one? How that or Quaxley. Oh fuck yeah. I I really want to I really want one of some of the other starters. Why why is it why is it all Japanese characters? Oh, because I'm doing a uh, surprise trade. You have no idea what oh. you're getting. I'm doing. Yeah, I'm, you probably I'm, was traded. I'm probably Pokemon was gambling. With somebody from uh, uh, was trading from somebody with somebody from another country. Yeah, probably in. Somewhere in Asia, I don't know. Because I couldn't see the characters. No, that's very fair. Well. My first instinct is Japan because Japanese game, but in hindsight, that may not be accurate. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even sure if like China or North Korea would allow them to. Oh well, yeah, Korea, South Korea would probably could would probably allow this so. though. Oh yeah, like South Korea, it, it's definitely oh. popular. God damn it! This fucking careless. Yeah, Bookworm says probably Japan because Nintendo's biggest company in Japan. Wait, really? Are they? I didn't realize that. Yeah. Yeah, that's where they originated. Well, from. like they're based in Japan. No, I mean that they are the biggest. They're company based in, in Japan. Japan. Oh, then most likely. 
I, I was talking about them being the biggest well, yeah. company in Japan. Well, there's actually another well, thing that's probably the second yeah. biggest company. Because I actually do notice from watching YouTube videos. I don't know if the, they're not top, Maybe but they're either, the, there's, they're either the second or the third, which is the Crane Machine Company. I forgot what they're called. The Crane Machine Company. They have the world's oh, biggest crane machine area in the world. Yeah, so, that, that oh, sounds okay. about right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that, that work. That that fits. Because, okay, I. Yeah, oh. they would have to. They would probably outfit like every uh like construction area like around the world potentially. So. Um. That's what you get with Monopoly. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, Adorna, for context, I decided... Okay. What? Go ahead. I was going to say, um, I am currently working, or very slowly working on, excuse me, fish decks in the background, or fish decks, the fish, fish deck, oh, in I almost... fish cards, God damn it! I almost said something bad. Bright, we're not talking I'm about class. Well, day. actually, actually, come to think of it, I'm focusing on sharks tonight, so claspers are <laughs> are here. But anyway, um, I'm working on my fish deck in the background, so I'm I'm getting like friend feedback while I'm doing it. I uh I I was suggested to get a nurse shark added to it, and I, one of the first images I found was a really cute image of a nurse shark. Wearing like the nurse hat thing, and we decided that the nurse shark is going to be called Nurse Joy Shark after Nurse Joy. Uh, I have no idea what to do with the meme. I, and I the, think my recommendation should go. I don't even remember your recommendation. All I remember of your recommendation is that my first instinct was to mute you. Was I muted? No, I, uh, I, I should say silence you, like on my end. 